Hello class, today we will be talking about a term used commonly in engineering. It is a hydraulic grade line. Before we define hydraulic grade line, we need to define hydraulics. Hydraulics is the study of how liquids like water move and how they can be used to move other things. When most people hear the word hydraulics, they think of this red tractor. The mechanisms that lift the scoop up are called hydraulics and they have pressurized liquid in them to make the hydraulics expand to raise the scoop. Another example of water moving in the, is in the ocean or a river. Hydraulics is used in both these cases to describe how liquids move. Based on our new knowledge of hydraulics, a hydraulic grade line is a graph of how a liquid, usually water, moves from one point to another, such as from the top of a mountain to the surface of a lake. The dark arrow in the middle of the page points to the hydraulic grade line. A rain gutter is a perfect example of what a hydraulic grade line can look like. When it rains, water hits the roof of a building and flows downwards into the rain gutter. Water can move back and forth inside the gutter, but the hydraulic grade line is the straight path along the rain gutter that the water travels under regular pressure. The blue arrow on the gutter shows that this hydraulic grade line follows the path of the water. These aqueducts are similar to a hydraulic grade line. Aqueducts were built many years ago to move water from lakes and streams to big cities. These channels of rock carried water many miles. The hydraulic grade line of these aqueducts, aqueducts would also be a straight line along the path of the water. Hydraulic grade lines are graphs that describe how liquids move from one point to another. They can be above the earth or beneath the earth. Hydraulic grade lines are used in many cases and combined with many other ideas. I hope you all better understand what a hydraulic grade line is. Thank you for listening.